breaking news, my lovely, wonderful people. Not be smarting they happen so with the year say APC that they consider merger. You go surprised with which political party. But well, that is the report reaching us at the moment. So APC and another political party are considering a merger. And it's the, the political parties and opposition as uh, Chudike wants of PDP extinction. He said because what the PDP won't do so, it will affect them. Why are you thinking of merging? Okay, you are one of the strongest opposition. He said currently what you are doing now, you are considering merging. And this merger, how will it profit you? How will it profit the people? You know, what's, the, what's in it for Nigerians? Please don't forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. APC consider merger with opposition as Chiduke warns of PDP extinction. The national chairman of the All Progressive Congress, Dr. Ganduji, has said opposition political parties could in no time distance merge with the ruling of Progressive Congress. Ganduji, who spoke to reporters at the APC National Secretariat in Abuja, said he will soon come up with a blueprint for achieving the objective. It will certainly improve the chances of our party, especially in 2027. And not only that, we are coming out with a new blueprint to increase followership. This will include all states, all officials, those who are in APC and those who are in other political parties. I assure you very soon, some of the political parties will even merge with APC. We are doing that on the ground already. We are making that to work. He also gave insight into his, delibera into his deliberation with the minister designated Yeson Wike. He has been taxed to ensure he brings this to fusion bringing members of his party already for the former from the for when the former river state governor visited abuja recently earlier in the week the visit of wiki a steward of the people democratic party has fueled speculation that the former governor was about to jump the ship he said you know wiki is an honorable minister he came we discussed because i was looking for him to congratulate him for that. And also, he came to congratulate me. We discussed that when he becomes minister fully, he will work very hard to move forward the ministry. He would be given and he's ready to cooperate. But we didn't discuss the issue of him coming to APC or not coming to APC. That issue will arise later. This came as PDP chieftain and former minister of aviation, Osita, warned that the party could become extinct if reforms are not made urgently. He also spoke, he said this is very, very important. He disclosed this when he appeared on China's television, Sunrise Daily, yesterday, stressing that the party lost some of the stronghold to Labour Party in the last election. He said PDP is a government that was in power for 16 years and right now the party seems to be losing its grip on what is really going on the party needs to reform and needs to put things in place or it will lose its relevance now we are beginning to see that pdp itself needs to be reformed yes it needs to be reformed and re-image itself to be able to begin to play major role knowing fully well that we have a political uh, we have a politician as a president so my lovely people, this is exactly what is happening right now. And um, by the time you look at the whole thing, you can see for a fact how things currently and truly are. And we all must begin to ensure that um, we work in place and we put things right in place to bring about the nation, you know, in the right perspective and in the right direction. So this is what is happening. Also, it has said there is opportunity, you know, and uh, some of these things are already playing out. You know, and APC is thinking of a merger. You know, it's thinking of a merger. Um, that's Ganduji saying that that they are working at it. Um, they, they are looking at opportunity for 2027 already. Any forward-thinking person should know that 2027 is around the corner. Yes, it's around the corner. Before you say Jack Robinson will be saying Happy New Year, whether you like it or not. 
I said, so those are some of the things and uh, him being a chairman, those are some of the prospects, you know, the, 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 the plans and the areas is looking at how, you know, his party can merge with other political parties and there'll be seriously and strictly no opposition. He says, so this is the, this is the game plan and this is what they are working on. We looked at the whole thing and it's not good. That kind of thing is not good. Now, back in other countries, let's take, for instance, the United Kingdom. Okay, let's start from our colonial masters, the United Kingdom. The United Kingdom have not just two main political parties, there are other political parties. Yes, we have the Labour and we have the Conservative. Now, why? what, what distinguishes these two parties is what this stands for. Why the Labour Party believes that? Let us open our gates. Let's bring in more people. Let's, let's um, give, give, give uh, more to the less privileged. Let's ensure that uh, we give more to this and that. Conservative, as the name implies, on the other hand, is saying, no, let us conserve. Let us shut the gates. If people are coming into the country, they should be professionals. Uh, what do we need to put in place? How do we need, you know, so it shows the disparity, okay, in belief of what they think will be able to build up their society. And this is how they operate based on their interests, based on what you feel is needed for the state, for the country, people begin to work on that, based on that very interest, people begin to work in line with that. You see, you see, you see people begin to work in line with that because of how they perceive, how they see things, or oh, how oh, they begin to work in line with that, you know. But in Nigeria, no political party has a distinct feature of what they, of what they represent or what they stand for. What exactly can you tell me is the, is the definition of PDP or APC? That this is what, so, so, so much so that APC member cannot cross to PDP because their, their motto does not align. What they see is totally, they see from a two, dif two different perspective. They see from two different perspectives altogether. There is no correlation at all in the alignment with what they believe and how they perceive or see things. So this is exactly what is happening and why we cannot afford to have the same thing over and over again. Leave us a comment. Please don't forget to like us, share, subscribe. God bless. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. And from us, is bye for now. Remember, you have a voice. And so we must speak out against everything that is against us. God bless. Bye-bye.